Candelaria, officially the municipality of Candelaria, Tagalog, Bayan ng Candelaria, is a first-class municipality in the province of Quezon, Philippines. According to the 2015 census, it has a population of 117,434 people, it is the third most populous municipality of Quezon after Lucena City and Saraya. Among the municipalities in Quezon Province, Candelaria has the most desiccated coconut factories and oil refineries, such as Peter Paul Philippine Corporation, Primex Cocoa Products Inc., Pacific Royal Basic Foods, Superstar Corporation, Tongson Industrial Development Corporation, and others, which employ thousands of people. History Foundation Prior to 1885, the pioneering barangays of Candelaria in its western part, Tagon, Bukal, Kinadahan and Mawson were parts of the municipality of Tiawang, while Malabanban, Mangilig and Sta. Catalina in the east, were under the jurisdiction of the town of Saraya. It was on December 26, 1878, that a permit was granted by the Governor-General of the Philippine Islands for the establishment of an independent government over these barangays. Its boundaries were fixed by means of a treaty signed by the notable leaders of Tiawang, Saraya and the founding families of Candelaria. The King of Spain, His Majesty Alfonso XII, finally approved the establishment of Candelaria as an independent town on August 5, 1879. American era and Japanese occupation in 1902, after the cessation of the general hostilities against the Americans, administration of Candelaria was merged with the neighboring town of Saraya. In 1908, after less than seven years, Candelaria was again managed independently, as a fourth-class municipality. During the American regime, the town progressed by leaps and bounds. Many houses and public edifices were constructed, and commerce and industries grew, until the Japanese invasion brought a further wave of destruction. Geography The municipality lies at the western part of Quezon Province, about 108 kilometers from the nation's capital, Manila and 23 kilometers from the provincial capital, Lucena City. To its northern part lies the famous Mount Banaha, to the east is the town of Saraya, to the south is San Juan, Batangas, and to the west are the towns of Dolores and Tiawan. The neighboring cities are Lucena, Tayabas, San Pablo and Lipa City. It is traversed by the Pan-Philippine Highway and the Philippine National Railways. Candelaria has an area of about 12,910 hectares and is an agricultural municipality, situated in the southern part of Mount Banaha. The town proper is wedged by two rivers, namely, Mawson and Quiapo rivers. Barangays Candelaria is politically subdivided into 25 barangays, listed here with their respective barangay captains and population as of 2015. Climate There are two pronounced seasons in Candelaria, dry and hot season from March to May, wet season from June to December. Typhoons struck the municipality every three to five years. The most remarkable or super typhoon Angela Rosing in 1995, Typhoon Zangsane Millenio in 2006, and Typhoon Ramasan Glenda in 2014. Normal temperatures in Candelaria range from 20 degrees Celsius (68 degrees Fahrenheit) to 32 degrees Celsius (90 degrees Fahrenheit). The temperatures became cooler in January with a range of about 18 degrees Celsius 64 degrees Fahrenheit, while in April, the hottest month, may rise of up to 36 degrees Celsius 97 degrees Fahrenheit. Topography Candelaria is more elevated in the northern part since it lies at the southern slope of Banaha and is predominantly agricultural. There are plantations of coconut and vegetables in its remote barangays. Most of the inhabitants are having poultry and livestock business and in the remaining part of the municipality are farmlands mostly of rice, corn, and other root crops. Demographics Condelaria has a population of 117,434 as of the 2015 census. 
The increase in population became rapid in the 1990s. In 1995, it has a population of 80,733 inhabitants, while in 2000, the population grew to 92,429, with an increase of about 15%. In 2007, the official number of inhabitants in the municipality based on 2007 census is 105,997, or about 4,240 families or 21,243 households. Most Candelarians reside in Pahinga Norte and Malabanban Norte, the adjacent barangays of the town proper. As of 2007, almost 93% of the population are Roman Catholics, 3.5% are Protestants, about 3% are members of Iglesia ni Cristo, 0.05% are of Islam, 0.97% are of other denominations such as Pentecostalists, Fundamental Baptist, Bible Baptist, Conservative Baptist, Latter-day Saints, Seventh-day Adventist, Jehovah's Witnesses and others. Language. Tagalog is widely spoken by the populace. However, their accent resembles the Tagalog dialect spoken in Batangas owing to its location, and history. Most of Candelarians came from the neighboring province of Batangas. Economy Candelaria is one of the most progressive municipalities in Quezon Province. Rapid progress have been felt since the 1990s where most of the commercial establishments have been built such as retail merchandising, supermarkets, Pure Gold, South Emerald, Ongbal, and others, hardware, fast food outlets or restaurants including Jollibee, McDonald's, Greenwich, Chowking, Mang I Nasal, Buddy's Restaurant, and others, Shopping Center, and others. The Candelaria Public Market, though it is adjacent to Barangay Poblacion, is located on Barangay Pahinga Norte. Places of interest Our Mother of Perpetual Health Parish Church of Tagon San Pedro Bautista Parish Church of Candelaria Quezon Premier Hotel and Resort Casa Patricia Hotel and Resort Burhan Bado, Masalakot 4 Mount Mayabobo in Barangay Mayabobo Mount Malasina in Barangay Masin Norte Tower Resort Pole Step, Dapian, Resort in Barangay Malabanban Sur Bukal Resort in Barangay Masalakot I Ongbal Hotel and Event Hall Grand Central Hotel Tilarog Resort in Barangay Masalakot I Uma Verde Econature Farm Candle Festival The town fiesta is celebrated on 5 February to honor the patron saint San Pedro Bautista. Since 2005, Monsignor Carlos Charles Pedro A. Herrera, the parish priest, started his devotion to Nuestra Senora de Candelaria and honored her with a candle festival every February 2. The celebration was concluded with a procession through the streets of the town featuring the street dancing by the youth of the community in honor of the Blessed Virgin. A parade of floats representing each of the 25 barangays was, also, featured during the festivities. A project in honor of the Blessed Mother Mary that will renovate the patio of the San Pedro Bautista Parish Church had been developed on April 22, 2012. The renovated patio will convert the current parking lot into a multi-purpose open amphitheater for use of the people of Candelaria. It will provide a venue for children and toddlers playground, jogging, walking path, a rosary garden, a Via Dolorosa, and a stage for performances complete with controlled theater lighting. The playground will be lit with lighting standards. The fundraising for the project will be accomplished through a 1,000 points of light campaign where each point of light will be represented by a Candelarian or Friends of Candelaria contributing PHP 5000 or more. Inauguration is scheduled for February 2, 2013, Candle Festival Celebration. Groundbreaking is targeted for August 4, 2012, ARAW in Candelaria. The community project is expecting every Candelarians around the world to step up and bring their Point of Light. The SPBPC Parish Council for Economic Affairs is taking the lead with Dr. Al Cornejo at the helm. 
Local government Elected officials 2016 to 2019 Mayor Macario D. Bungaling NPC Vice Mayor George D. Swayan NPC Councilors Maria Ilana L. Asistio NPC Benildo C. Bellin NPC Lydell M. Dizon Liberal Party Manuel Antonio V. De Luna, Liberal Party. Rodante A. Padillo, NPC. Marcelo Q. Lego, NPC. Julius D. Maniebo, NPC. Darren P. De Gala, NPC. Former heads and mayors, 1879 to 2018. Infrastructure Transportation Road network There are three major highways that pass throughout the municipality and the town proper. The South Luzon Expressway Toll Road 4, TR4 stretching from Sto. Tomas, Batangas to Lucina City will pass in the northern part of the municipality, planned to be finished in 2021. The new expressway will occupy portions of Barangays Bukal Norte, Masalakat II, Masalakat I, Mayabobo, and Mangalig Norte. The Pan-Philippine Highway, also known as Maharlika Highway or National Highway, passes through the municipality west-east from Barangay Bukal Sur to Barangay Mangalig Sur. It connects the municipality to its neighboring towns of Tiawang and Saraya, and cities like San Pablo City in Laguna and Lucena City, the provincial capital. The Candelaria Balbuc Road, also known as Candelaria San Juan Road, is a 16 kilometers (9.9 miles) two-lane highway that starts at the Pan-Philippine Highway junction in Barangay Malabanban Norte, going straight south to the municipality of San Juan, Batangas. This is an alternative road for commuters from Metro Manila via Batangas. The Candelaria Bypass Road, also known as Candelaria Diversion Road, is a two-lane bypass road that serves as an alternative road for commuters from Metro Manila to Batangas and Bicol region. Opened in 2012, this 7.8 kilometers (4.8 miles) road starts at Barangay Bukal Sur, turning south to Barangays Masan Sur, Pahinga Norte, Malabanban Sur, and Mangalig Sur. It intersects the Candelaria Balbuc Road at Barangay Malabanban Sur and crosses the Philippine National Railway in Mangalig Sur. It ends at the eastern portion of Maharlika Highway right after United Candelaria Doctors Hospital. There are also major roads within the municipality. Rizal Avenue is the two lane main road located in Barangay Poblacion. It connects Barangay Masan Norte and Sur in the west and Malabanban Norte in the east. Some landmarks located here are the Municipal Hall, Catholic Church, and Plaza Nara. Cabanig Street also in Barangay Poblacion is the municipality's main business district. Most of business establishments such as hardware stores like Likup, Builders the oldest hardware store in town, RTWs, pharmacies, footwear, general merchandise, and restaurants are located here. It also serves as a thoroughfare for local commuters going to nearby barangays such as Pahinga Norte and Masalakot I. Ramos Street Masalakot Barangay Road is a road that starts at Maharlika Highway in Barangay Poblacion and ends at Barangay Masalakot 3. This is also an access road to most of subdivisions located in Barangay Masalakot I such as School View Park Subdivision, Village of St. Jude, VSJ, Maria Cristina Village, St. Anthony Subdivision, Villa Macaria Country Homes, Clarice Subdivision, Faustin Florival, and others. There are also schools located along the road, such as Gravesum School Inc. and Dr. Panfilo Castro National High School Annex. Tabonglan Road is a dirt road that serves as a main access to Barangay Mayabobo from Maharlika Highway in Barangay Malabanban Norte, in front of Iglesia Ni Cristo Church. Pahinga Kinadahan Road is a Barangay road that starts at Cabanig Street down south to Barangay Kinadahan II. It serves as an access road to Candelaria Bypass Road from the town proper. Some landmarks located along the road are Peter Paul Philippine Corporation, Pahinga Norte Elementary School, Kokoma, and Villa Katrina Subdivision. 
The junction located in Barangay Pahinga Norte right after the spillway across Quiapo River connects it towards Barangay Santa Catalina Norte. Mangalig Concepcion Road is a barangay road that starts at Maharlika Highway in Mangalig Sur and an access road to Barangays Mayabobo and Concepcion Banaha in Saraya, Quezon. Some landmarks found here are Dr. Panfilo Castro National High School, Mangalig Norte Elementary School, and Mount Mayabobo. Public transport Provincial buses to and from Metro Manila and Lucena City such as Jack Liner Inc., DLTBCO, Jam Liner and Lucena Lines stops at the municipality's designated bus stop located in Poblacion for passengers. There are also jeepney terminals located in the town proper. For passengers going to Lucena City, the terminal is located in Rizal Avenue Corner Gonzales Street in front of Bank of the Philippine Islands Branch. For passengers going to San Pablo City, the terminal is located beside Metrobank in Rizal Avenue Corner del Valle Street. For passengers going to San Juan, Batangas the terminal is located in Gonzales Street. Tricycles are the most common mode of transportation in the municipality. There are lots of tricycle terminals in Barangay Poblacion, serving local commuters to the nearby barangays. Water transport Candelaria has no coastline and is one of the inland municipalities of Quezon Province, together with Dolores, Lucban, Sampaloc, San Antonio, Tayabas, and Tiawan. The seaport nearest to the municipality is Dalahican Port in Lucena City for passengers going to Marinduque, Masbate, and other island provinces. Dalahican Port is about 30 kilometers from Candelaria. Among the international seaports in Luzon, Batangas Port in Batangas City is the nearest. It would take approximately two hours in a private vehicle to reach from Candelaria, passing through the municipalities of San Juan, Rosario, and Aban, Batangas. Air transport Candelaria has no airport, runway or any facility to accommodate air operations. The nearest airbase in the municipality is the San Fernando Airbase in Lipa City with a distance of about 32 kilometers west of the municipality, while the nearest international airport is the Ninoy Aquino International Airport in Pasay City. For air travelers, you have to travel for more or less two hours to reach Metro Manila and a couple of minutes more for Ninoy Aquino International Airport in case of traffic obstructions. Communications Condelaria is served by General Telephone System, Inc. GTSI, and Digital Telecommunications PLDT Digital, as the main telecommunication services providers. GTSI has started its operations in the municipality in 1981, making it the third municipality where it started its operation, the first two are Gumaca in 1977 and Adamonan in 1979. Internet shops are commonly found in the town proper. Health care Condelaria has three hospitals, one public and two private. Candelaria Municipal Hospital, known as Nursery, built in 1984, located in Barangay Masan Norte. Peter Paul Medical Center, formerly Peter Paul Hospital, built in 1948, located in Regidor Street, Barangay Poblacion. United Candelaria Doctors Hospital, built in 2009, located in Maharlika Highway near Candelaria Bypass Road, Barangay Mangalig Sur. The Candelaria Municipal Hospital is built during the administration of then Mayor Pedro Chedeno in 1984. Peter Paul Medical Center is one of the pioneering hospitals of the municipality, established in 1948. United Candelaria Doctors Hospital is the newly built medical facility of Candelaria, opened in February 2009. Each barangay has its own health center for free health services. More lying in clinics are located throughout the municipality. Education Preschool Brentley Montessori School Brisbane Integrated School Primary Secondary Manuel S. Inverga University Foundation Candelaria, Inc. 
Newton Science School Inc. GRABSUM School, Inc. The Lady Mediatrix Institute, Inc. Tayabas Western Academy STA. Catalina National High School Bukal Sur National High School Manuel Macasat National High School Dr. Panfilo Castro National High School Dr. Panfilo Castro National High School, Masalakot I Annex Tertiary Manuel S. Inverga University Foundation, Candelaria Campus Tayabas Western Academy Compskill Learning Academy Crisville Institute of Technology GRABSUM School, Inc. References External links Philippine Standard Geographic Code Philippine Census Information Local Governance Performance Management System Quezon Province Business Directory and Travel Guide Quezon Province Web Portal Lucena City Community Website